is Sunday, which means that Sarah and I are going to go to the Rose Bowl. Ah. For Sarah and I, this is both our um, third trip, third consecutive trip to the Rose Bowl. Uh, and even though it's like my third time, and even though the outcome will probably be the same as the last two years, I'm still really excited about it. Uh, it's the experience, you know, it's traveling with your friends and, you know, just being someplace that's not home. How's it going? I hate traveling. You hate Hi, traveling. camera! <laughs> We're going! No, Rose Bowl! I have my bucket hat somewhere, but it's like in my, in my bag, so... Yeah. We have like seven hours in LA to find it, so... Yes! <laughs> we got time. We got time. <laughs> we drove down to Chicago to catch our evening flight. We got a lot of random airport footage, and the seven hour layover in Las Vegas eventually drove us crazy. And now everything is funny. Because we're having... We've lost our minds. We've lost our minds. We are delirious. We're and delirious. there's not nearly enough coffee to fix this problem. No, definitely not. <laughs> we arrived in Pasadena the next morning, where we enjoyed a long overdue nap, some shopping, and New Year's Eve celebrations. We awoke the next morning to find the streets ready for the Rose Parade. Our hotel was right on Colorado Boulevard, which is part of the parade's route, so we had front row seats to the floats. All the places will go, and yeah. we went to the Rose Bowl. Alright, so we just saw the parade, um, which you probably saw some footage of. Oh, and then Sarah's there. Sarah's getting ready. Hi. <laughs> the hat. Sarah's gonna wear her hat. But look at this awesome scarf that she got last the night. Scarf. It's, it's got it, Bucky. It's got Bucky and, and the Rose Bowl thing. Yep. <laughs> and it says Badgers. Yeah. Because so. we have a good mascot. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Did you know that Stanford's mascot is a tree? A yes. freaking tree. And it's this really weird looking disjointed thing, like their actual physical mascot. It kind of has just these weird pieces and you can see the person's legs yep. like in an awkward kind of way. And it has this, these <laughs> lips and these eyes that just kind of bobble about. Nothing like our majestic regal Bucky Badger. They should have carried an actual tree, like in the parade just now. I think it would have been better if they had an actual tree with them. But this mascot, no. Yeah, no. No. Show me ticket, Maya. Ticket. Ticket. Oh, glare. Ticket. So next time you see us, we will either be victors or Woo! drinking away our sorrows. Win or lose, we still booze. Yep. <laughs> Win or lose, we still booze. All right, on Wisconsin! on Wisconsin! From there, we headed to the Rose Bowl, where we joined our fellow Badgers as we took some photos in front of the stadium. Stanford was similarly dressed in red, so it was funny to walk around a completely red stadium that wasn't Camp Randall. Good morning. It is Wednesday, January 2nd, 2013. Oh, happy New Year. Now we're going to go see the um, floats because they have like a little thing where you get to see the floats up close, right? I've never yep. done this before. Yeah, yeah. I haven't done it either, but you get to go and see all the parade floats up close and you can smell all the flowers. And it's really, really fun because I love flowers. <laughs> so I'm excited. I'm excited too. As we wandered through the showcase of floats, stopping to admire these works of art, it got me thinking about how we don't often stop to smell the roses in our adult life. It's usually go, go, go as we hustle from class to class or job to job. We have so many responsibilities to attend to that we forget to just stop and enjoy what's right in front of us. Even during this mini vacation in Pasadena, at times I felt like I was being herded from one event to the next. But that day, walking by the floats, I didn't feel the need to rush through everything. It was just nice to stop and smell the roses.
They smell really pretty. <laughs> they smell really good. Smell them, smell them through the camera. <laughs>